All right, Wednesday. Absolutely beautiful morning. The sun is out and I can feel the warmth on my back, which is super cool. And it's really not near as cold as it has been the last few days out here. Um, squat day today. Uh, did some <clears throat> heavy squats, then we did some heavy front squats. Then we did some pause squats, which were, those were killer. Um, and <clears throat> finished off with some accessories and so on. Um, so strength program is going pretty good so far. Um, <clears throat> and I do feel like I'm getting stronger. So getting the job done. And the first form app is really helping out with the strength program that I'm working in in the app. So um, that's super cool. Um, <sighs> we all have things that we can complain about. And we all have things that we complain about throughout our day. And well, let me start over. I know I have things I can complain about. I have things that I complain about throughout the day sometimes. Not all the time, but sometimes. And <clears throat> whenever we're complaining, I d whenever I'm complaining, I'm not trying to uh, accuse you guys of anything. <laughs> um, like, I don't know what you guys deal with, but I know that sometimes I deal with complaining. Whether it's I don't want to do the workout or whether it's I don't want to get up in the morning or um, I'm tired, I don't feel good or any anything that you can complain about. Um, and sometimes when I'm complaining like that, I know that what I need to do is audit what I'm complaining about. And am I complaining about a problem that I can solve? Or am I complaining about a predicament that I'm going to have to deal with no matter what, right? Um, like the cold. The cold is a predicament that I'm going to have to work with or work around. <clears throat> and complaining is not going to do any good. But it's also a problem I can solve by bundling up, putting gloves on, a coat on. So nearly anything you're complaining about is a problem that can be solved. Nearly anything you're complaining about on a daily basis is a problem that you can solve and that you can overcome. So just something to think about for today and um, something to help us keep on the right track uh, as we continue to pursue our goals. So I love you guys. Let's have an amazing day. We can always control our effort. We can always control our attitude. And we can definitely control our smile. So, give some smiles out today. I love you guys. I think Gracie and you should ask the What's up?
Long time no talk. I am going to take advantage of the sunshine. I'm going to do my mile run today. The temperature says it's supposed to be warmer tomorrow, but it also says that the sun's not going to be out. So I'm kind of, I want the sunshine. So I'm going to run today. Anyway, um, don't mind my non-makeup face. Totally different look than the banquet. Look at my kitty. <laughs> uh, so cute. That's Maul Ball. Darth Maul. Named after Star Wars Darth Maul. Yeah. Anyway, um, so I'm going to run. Keep my promise of at least a mile in a week. I don't really want to, but I'm all about keeping them promises to myself because it helps me stay confident. Helps me kick ass and helps show my neighbors what they need to do to hold up the American obligation. A <laughs> big snooze. Mm. Got my post workout here because I just got done working out. <clears throat> I use First Form Formula One and First Form Ignition. And paired together, they put me in the recovery process as soon as possible. Um, because when we're working out, when we're doing resistance training, we're creating micro tears in our muscles and we're also depleting our muscle energy or our muscle glycogen. And so, with the, with the amino acids from the rapid assimilation protein, the Formula One, and also the high glycemic carbohydrate, the ignition, like I said, paired together, they're gonna put me in the recovery process as soon as possible. The ignition is gonna help shuttle that amino acids to the muscles super fast. It's also going to blunt cortisol and blunt and stop the muscle breakdown process. Right here, I got my absolute favorite flavor, chocolate mint cookie I love that flavor um, and the other cool thing about it is one scoop of this formula one is 20 grams of protein so it also helps me hit my protein goals during the day <clears throat> and we all know that it's super important to get the protein in to preserve the lean muscle tissue and to keep us strong and healthy in all areas of our body um, so Get your post-workout in. <laughs> Today we did uh, overhead press. Um, I kind of like overhead press day. It's kind of nice, but it is also um, not quite as intense of a workout, really. Um, you're kind of just burning up them shoulders the whole time. Uh, and then I finished it off with a little med con of like rower and burpees. and uh, That always kind of sucks, but... It was good, I feel good about it, and I'm ready for an amazing Thursday. It's gonna be a busy day, but I'm ready for it. Why am I ready for it? Because I put the work in every day to be ready for the trials and tribulations, to be ready for the situations and problems that come my way, and to be ready for the good and the smiles and the opportunities that come my way as well. <clears throat> And that kind of goes into the next thing that I kind of wanted to talk about today. I think oftentimes we get caught up in every day and we just keep going, right? And we, we just get in this groove of always doing things that benefit us or make things easier for us. My hand's shaking a little bit. <clears throat> Whether that be a task or... Um, really anything we we try to make it benefit us or do something to our advantage or simply try to make something easier for us but today i'm going to challenge myself and i want to challenge you guys to make it easier on somebody else 
do something for the benefit of somebody else. Okay? I love you guys. Let's have an amazing Thursday. Get your post-workout in. If you have any questions about the post-workout, let me know. Okay? I love you guys. Let's have an amazing Thursday. All right, another beautiful morning. A little chilly, a little breezy. Uh, just got done doing a good round of deadlifts. Um, and some leg press. We weren't able to get to everything in the workout, but that's totally fine. Still got my, oh man, sun's out. Still got my three mile run in. Um, ended with a thousand miles, a thousand meter ski. Oh, a thousand miles would suck. <laughs> okay. So yeah, starting off the morning right. Gosh, that is beautiful. Yes, it is. You see that? It's gorgeous. Um, so this might come across a little harsh, but I don't need it to be harsh. Well, maybe a little bit. But a few questions for you. What are you doing today to make the world a better place? What are you doing today to prove to the universe that you deserve the success and deserve the desires of your heart? What are you doing to prove to God that you are worthy of his blessings? Simple questions that we need to be asking ourselves. What are we doing every day to get better? So, Ask yourself those questions, think about it. Examine yourself, examine your actions. Examine the way you treat people. Examine your relationships. Examine every step you take. See where you can get better. Identify opportunities. And determine whether or not you are doing what needs to be done to get to where you want to be. I'm here for you. There are plenty more here for you. And I love you. I'm cold. I'm going to go inside and say goodbye to this sun until later. I love you guys. Have an amazing Friday. <laughs>